Welcome to this episode of Organic Poultry Farming. With the help of poultry engineering and technology, we introduce you to non-toxic eggs and organic egg production. Self-sufficiency in egg production is still a dream in spite of the facilities and resources in our country. Every day, trucks loaded with toxic eggs laden with toxins by use of antibiotics, insulin, formalin, hormones, cholesterol, etc. enter our state borders. Organic farming is the new global trend. These trends, along with the increase in population, pose a challenge to agriculture for producing more and better food. The global poultry industry has advanced significantly over the last several decades. Egg-laying hens is the most popular in poultry farming. Micro-layer system is a solution to those with only a small quantity of flow space. In cities, a poultry lover can hardly spare open land for rearing birds. For all such people, this system will be of worth cause it helps keeping birds in minimal space. Responsibilities and burdens of daily life led to the search of a better livelihood in desert countries. R. Anil Kumar of Anad is an NRI to start a poultry farm when he faced job insecurity and layoffs that led to tough times abroad. As soon as he came to India, he started a micro-layer high-tech poultry farm. Per day, this ex-NRI gets an average of 88 eggs from this profitable, attractive and an easy backyard farm. His wife Rija Daughter Anaka and younger son Abhinav are dedicated and interested in supporting him in this high-tech egg farm. To sell all the eggs and to meet the demands of the buyer, they need to expand and increase the number of hens. Concentration on care has made these farmers very successful. type egg-laying hen's poultry shed with a chain-linked metal cage that protects the birds from dogs, cats, mongoose, snakes, crows, kites, falcons and other predators is provided. It also has enough space around the cage 
for an adult to walk around it. In battery system metal cages, each rack can accommodate five birds. These birds can live perched naturally like on the branches of trees and have enough airy space. Feeder bowls are arranged in such a way that there is a feed available always and is easily accessible. For water to be available automatically, float valves with nipples and pipes are being provided with nipple cups. A water tank is also arranged to store the necessary water. Large eggs with brown colored shells is a favorite among the buyer. The specialty of these eggs are a smaller yellow yolk and a more white of the egg, lesser cholesterol and presence of more omega-3 fatty acids make these eggs a special treat. People living here are already aware that toxic substances like hormones, antibiotics, formalin and insulin are not given to these hens. They mention they are filled with a sense of satisfaction and joy on seeing the birds fed with natural leaves and grass. A farmer is trained by the company to take care for these non-brooding egg-laying variety of hens that can lay up to 400 eggs. The hens are replaced when they no longer can lay eggs by the agency. The return on initial investment is gained within a year and a half. The profit from the sale of the hens after they are done egg laying and the arrival of new hens is the additional attractive prospects of this farming. The agency arranges for the project to be covered by insurance for the first year. The following year, the customer pays the insurance. The second time the hens arrive, the customer provides the feed for the chicken up to the time of egg laying. Many lakhs of unemployed people in our country can benefit from egg laying hen farming without any kind of fear. These farmers prove that non-toxic food can be provided for people. Our Anil Kumar plans to expand his farm which is a steady source of income and joy. <laughs>